health lovers it is day 15 and i'm noticing more of the physical benefits of living a highly raw lifestyle in december of 2023 i weighed in at 144 nine days in at 138 and on day 15 at 135. 135 is a very comfortable weight for me i feel very light and airy versus 144 i felt very bloated and heavy so it's nice getting that benefit alone. I started off the day by drinking plenty of water and I fav had my favorite adaptogen, ashwagandha, which really helps me with stress. And then I broke my fast with some carrots and broccoli. I needed something quick because I was working on things for my business today and I got hungry again. So I finished off that bag of carrots. I followed that up with some pure apple juice I mixed it with a red apple and Granny Smith. And then when it was time for me to have a larger meal, I decided to put some raw veggies in a bowl. So we have cilantro, shiitake mushrooms, purple onion, tomatoes, and seaweed. And then I poured my broth over the top of the veggies. And this reminds me of my favorite recipe, which is pho or pho, however you say it but it's just really warm and comforting, especially on a snow day. Now with being raw, I ideally would like to keep everything raw, but with anemia, I just, I can't play with myself like that. I know I need warming herbs like cayenne and this soup broth really helps me out. So I'm trying to figure out how to live my best raw life while honoring myself at the same time. At 7.30, I had a big bowl of grapes and then some apple juice. But all in all, day 15 was really smooth. The cleanse is going really well. I'm just grateful to be at this point in my journey because I remember eight years ago, I wasn't thinking about raw food. I was thinking about vegan junk food. So I thank God for the wins and I'm gonna keep going. And my prayer is that you keep going and that we keep going together and that we get healthier all 2024. But I love y'all and until day 16, Take care.